What happens to your body when you have an allergic reaction? You must have known someone around you who suffers from bad allergic symptoms like runny nose, watery eyes, sneezing, irritation, and many others. An allergic reaction is a reaction to a certain allergen. It is a chain of reactions that begins from the genes and is expressed through the immune system of the body. The immune system of your body gets activated once you have an allergic reaction. The immune system is the one that defends the body against infections. For instance, if you suffer from a dust allergy or pollen allergy, then the body identifies it as an invader and overreacts in reaction to the allergen. The immune system produces antibodies which are known as IgE antibodies. These specific antibodies reach the cells and result in the release of chemicals, which leads to an allergic reaction. The reaction then results in a series of symptoms within the sinuses, nose, lungs, throat, stomach lining, ears, or skin. There are various IgE antibodies in the body that are specific to the radar to a specific allergen. This indicates that some people are specifically allergic to dust, some are allergic to cat dander, and others are allergic to pollen and many different forms of allergies. It is not clearly understood which substances trigger an allergic reaction and which don't. Some people respond to allergens while others don't. The only thing which is known for now is that family history matters a lot when we talk about allergies. 50 to 60 million Americans suffer from allergic disease, and all of them suffer from different types of allergic diseases. The common allergic disease which is seen worldwide is hay fever or allergic rhinitis. This allergic disease commonly occurs during spring, summer, or fall where the person suffers from sneezing, runny nose, and itchy skin, redness of eyes, or watery eyes. When the person suffers from allergic symptoms year-round, then it occurs due to indoor allergens like pets, indoor molds, or dust mites. Hives or urticaria is the allergic skin reaction where it becomes red and bumpy. It occurs due to certain medications or food. Eczema or atopic dermatitis is also a skin reaction, but it occurs due to certain products where the skin suffers from itching, flaking, peeling, or redness over the skin. Allergic conjunctivitis is an eye allergy where the eyes react to different allergens, leading to swelling, redness, and itching. Food allergies are also common where the person suffers from immediate coughing and bronchospasm due to certain proteins and food items. People suffering from asthma also have allergic rhinitis where they suffer from chest tightness, breathing difficulties, wheezing and swelling of the airways which can narrow the air passages. Anaphylaxis is a severe form of an allergic reaction which is life-threatening. This allergic reaction occurs either due to insect stings, foods, latex, or different medicines. For diagnosing the different allergies, patients are usually advised to visit the allergist or an immunologist who can help in identifying the allergy and help treat them. Allergy skin tests, blood tests, family history, and many other tests are advised depending on your allergic reactions. Once the allergen is identified, the allergist then suggests the treatment plan for relieving the allergic reaction. Certain tablets, immunotherapy shots, and antihistamines are prescribed to relieve the symptoms. However, still there is no specific cure for relieving allergic reactions completely. But proper treatment plans aid in making your life and health better. We hope that you are learning something new every day from our videos. If you'd like to know about a specific topic, inbox us, email us, or comment down below.